What's up, shark fans? I'm Jonathan Pageant, and this is my teammate, the great Darwin Lowe. On today's episode of Shark Weekly, we'll give you a recap of all of last week's results and get you ready for the weekend. After a tough game on Monday following the Hurricane Irma break, we bounced back on Saturday and found the back of the net five times against Flagler. Yours truly scored the first goal of the match, followed by two goals from my boy Noel Johnson and one from the Stone Cold Juan Estavia. The five goals are the most we've scored under the gaffer, Matt Watts, and we look forward to taking on Florida Tech at home on Tuesday night at 7. After not playing since September 2nd, volleyball hit the road and picked up two conference Ws against Embry-Riddle and Florida Tech this past weekend. Denver Tyler Palmer was named the Sunshine State Conference Offense Player of the Week. After recording the double-doubles over the weekend with a combined 54 kills, the Sharks will play three conference matches this week, including Eckerd and St. Leo at home on Friday and Saturday. Despite a tough home loss this past Saturday, women's soccer took down the number 22 team in the country last Wednesday. The Sharks beat Embry-Riddle 3-1 and had goals from Laura Peterson, Alexis Nowak, and Myra Troutman. The girls will travel to Florida Tech on Wednesday and play Rollins at home this coming Saturday. The cross-country team competed in Traveca NCAA Division II Showcase in Nashville this past weekend. Scott Grease finished 14th overall on the men's side, while Michelle Bauer finished 22nd overall on the women's side. The team will be back in action on Friday at the flrunners.com Invitational in Lakeland. Lastly, the baseball team continued its annual tradition this past Friday, spending a night at the Miracle League. Hear what senior catcher Brandon Cutting had to say about the event. This is definitely an experience I look forward to every fall that we get to come out here as a team. And it's quite amazing the lessons that you can learn even in the short time that we're here. Um, but these kids are truly awesome. And uh, I, think, I think we have a better time spending time with them than they do out here. It's truly, truly rewarding. That's all we have for you today, Shark fans. Be sure to tune in next week for all the latest and greatest news out of NSU. For my teammate Darwin, I'm Padge. Believe in the process. <laughs>